the suspect and, and a lady friend was in, in my poker room. He, uh, he stopped at the counter and uh, didn't say anything. Uh, and I was right next to him at the time. And they had left and the police department uh, was watching the vehicle. And as soon as they got in the vehicle, all, all the cars came around it. And when they got in there, all kinds of vehicles come in to block his exit and come in from both sides and uh, heavily armed officers were there and it, it went without incident, I'm glad to, to hear. I, at my place it was business as usual I, until, uh, until I started looking at my tapes to find out what went on and, and even then I, I didn't know until I think you told me. We were right inside the door, never saw, nobody said anything, no noise, there was no sirens that I heard or anything, they just come in and did their thing. and. I looked back at my tapes and everything, and uh, he didn't, neither one of them uh, did anything unusual. I'm glad he's, they've caught him because I, I think uh, this whole area was uh, worried about if that propane would have went off, if it would have hurt somebody and did a lot more damage. And uh, to know that we had a bomber in our society, uh, is uh, you don't hear about that every day. So I think uh, the whole community is relieved.